I'm Yaf. Uh, Cash. What are you doing? I'm in 8th grade. What's one of your hobbies? Uh, I, like, I do sports. What's your favorite class slash subject? Uh, PE. Who's your favorite teacher? Miss Milliken. How do you feel, how do you feel being uh, student of the week? Uh, I feel good. Who do you think should be student of the week next? Amani Hampton. Alright, thank you. Clean the world, no more pollution. Clean the whole world together. Um, purify lake with basketball and your guys. Clean the oceans. What's your name? Mr. Baldwin. What subject do you teach? I teach special education, reading, writing, and math. What's your favorite color? Blue. If you could teach one subject, what would it be and why? Uh, I love the subjects that I teach. Math and reading and writing kind of cover all the bases. What's your favorite food? My favorite food would probably have to be curry. How do you feel about being staff of the week? Feel pretty good, appreciate it. A uh, couple shout outs to favorite teacher friends, Miss Walker. Uh, my co-teachers, Miss uh, Childs and Mr. Greer, along with all the other staff that are super supportive and help our kids out. Okay, thank you. All right, hey, good afternoon, Cougars. Hey, I want to say we appreciate all your hard work and getting your grades up. Our grades are the best they've been here in probably about 16 months. Understand we have some great teachers, great opportunities to catch up those grades that you missed. Remember, text correction is on you. But we are providing you great opportunities to do that. We got teachers staying after school for study support. Teachers you can go talk to before, before school, after school, and during lunch. So let's continue. We've got about 40 days left. Continue pushing forward and ensuring that you get the best grade you can as you get ready to move on to the next school or next grade. So we appreciate your hard effort. Keep it up. And we believe in you guys. Hey, this is just a reminder that we have state testing coming up soon. Uh, testing officially begins next Tuesday. You will test out of your fifth period teacher's class. So important that you do your best. Uh, class placements for honors and intervention are based off how well you do both in the ELA and math. And this impacts even the classes you might be placed in when you move on to the high school. And if you are an ML student placed right now taking ELA in an ML class, if you do well enough on both your WIDA test and your state assessment, you actually can test out of ML classes and be put into regular gen ed classes. So everybody put their best foot forward and get going on those state assessments. Good morning and happy Tuesday, Olympic. This is Mr. Lewis. Just kind of wanted to share with you guys uh, the fact that I'm very proud of the culture that the students, as well as the staff, was creating at Olympic. Um, kind of one of the things I've talked about a few different times is just we want to make this a place that everybody wants to come to every day. And you guys are really starting to do that, and I appreciate that. Sometimes we don't tell you, and sometimes we don't always let it be known how proud that we are, but 
I love saying when people are like, hey, where do you work at? I work at Olympic Middle School. So I want you guys to know that you guys are doing a, well, a great job and to keep it up. Thank you.